How many people have friends or family that are in some branch of the military? I know I have friends and family that are in part of the military. Um, the organization I chose to do was the National Allegiance of Homeless Veterans. You don't want your friend or family member to end up like that guy over there looking for a rich wife because he's homeless. Um, they're a nonprofit organization. Uh, they have members. Their board of directors is 13 members long. They're funded by state, local, federal organizations to help their organization grow and prevent veterans from becoming homeless. Um, they provide housing, food, health services, and even help them try to find jobs and train them for certain jobs to try to get them back on their feet someday. Um, their goal is to end homelessness with veterans. Um, one of their branches is the, run by the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs. They estimate that every night 1,300, or sorry, 130,000 veterans are homeless every night. And throughout the course of the year, that doubles. Uh, most of the veterans that are homeless suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder. Homeless veterans come from all the wars dating back to World War II. Many of them are still homeless from World War II. Um, some facts about the homeless people. 23% of homeless people in America are U.S. veterans. And that's like saying one out of four people that are in the Army are going to be homeless one day. That's kind of sad if you ask me, somebody who served our country. Um, it's an even greater number for male homeless people. 33% of them are veterans. 47% um, of the homeless veterans served for Vietnam. 67% um, of veterans served for three or more years for our country. Uh, 33 were stationed. 33 percent were stationed in a war zone for three or more years. 85 percent of homeless veterans earned their high school degree or their GED at some point in their life, and unfortunately, they're stuck on the street. And 70, 76 percent of homeless veterans experience drug, alcohol, or post-traumatic stress disorder. Um, the goal of this organization is to help veterans that cannot get a job because 45% of them that try to get a job cannot get a job. And then 37% of homeless veterans that try to afford housing cannot afford it, so that's why they end up being homeless. Um, the sad part is this organization, organization isn't that big, so less than half of them are reached by this organization, so many of them are stuck without help, unlike other. Um, this organization reaches out for them in many different ways. Um, I don't expect anybody to help, but maybe someday you would be able to help somebody homeless. Um, I hope everyone enjoyed listening about our homeless veterans and how sad that is. Um, unfortunately, there is that many people that are homeless in our country. And next time you see a homeless man, I hope you realize that he could have served your country one day and fought for your freedom. Thank you.